What's going on everybody? Dominic back here with yet another new power video. In today's video, we'll be uh, starting our mounting bracket series. So today we'll be talking about our universal Z brackets. Uh, we'll be discussing what wattage panels they work best with. And I'm gonna show you guys how to install one of these on a corner of your solar panel. So stick around and let's hop right into the video. So you get four Z brackets. Now, uh, these are the universal brackets, so they're suitable for most 10 watt to 210 watt solar panels. Um, smaller gauge screws may be required, uh, but these mounts work great with uh, 80 watt to 210 watt panels. Just be aware that if you do have larger wattage panels, um, two sets may be required. Okay, so now I'm gonna show you guys how to mount a Z bracket to your panel. So in terms of mounting hardware, here's a couple things you're gonna need. You need this bolt right here. It comes, everything I'm about to show you comes with your bracket. So you need a small bolt, a washer, a crush washer, and a nut. Take your bracket, put it on, your. so see this lip right here? This goes on the side of the panel, like so, just like that. It's on there, and then you take your bolt, you push it through. Now, these notches are solely, or which one you choose is solely dependent on your application. So you may choose to run your mount forward, so closer in towards the middle of the panel, or let's say you wanna run it further out, more stability, you would choose this notch right here. And then you can adjust the width by just moving it like so. You get about a quarter to a half an inch of play, which it should be enough. Now, let's say I choose the middle, just gonna push my bolt in like so. You then take your crush washer, and then lastly, you take your nut, and you just hand tighten it down, and leave it semi-loose, because you may still want to, you know, adjust it, right? It, depending on your application. Now when it comes to mounting it to an application, it's super simple. You take the included long screw, put it in here, and then you then screw it down into your application of choice. Super simple, just like that, done. All right, folks, so as we close out this video, I hope it was super helpful to you guys. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. If you have any questions, drop them down below in our comment section. Also, we'll be coming out with more videos in regards to mounts as well as many other products. So make sure you hit that notification bell to be notified when that video goes live. Everybody, this is Dominic from New Power, and I'll see you on the next one.